Rachel Ellis joins us live on campus this morning with more on the planning process ahead of some of those big events. Rachel, good morning. Devante, Audrey, good morning to you both. Well, of course, a lot of planning goes into uh, putting together such a big event like this. It's why we wanted to bring in two seniors and student leaders here at North Carolina a and Madison and Taylor, thank you both for joining us. You know, first off, can you just tell us a little bit what does actually go into planning this? How long does it take? Just walk us through that process a bit. Wow, so for this event, nothing but time, dedication, student input, all of that. Um, it definitely took up our summer, um, all of the beginning of our first semester, but with this event, it was just so much fun and we just put in so much time and dedication. Wonderful, and as seniors, what does this, this event mean to you in particular this year? Honestly, homecoming is the best part of being at an HBCU and I'm looking forward to this one in particular because it is my senior year and we haven't had one since my sophomore year and the fact that I was able to have planned it alongside Madison means the world to me. Wonderful. And um, for you both, what are you looking forward to the most? You, whoever wants to hop in. Um, I guess my favorite part that I'm looking forward to is our pet rally. Um, it's the liveest event that we have on campus. Um, the most people come out and I'm just really excited. All right. Well, thank you. And speaking of the pep rally, we have some performers here behind us. Uh, if you all just want to play us out for a bit, what people can expect at the pep rally and the football game on Saturday, please go ahead. We'd love to hear it. Incredible. I get chills every time I listen.